pressure likes to go from high pressure to low pressure, always likes to equal out. When you inhale, your diaphragm contracts, which allows air to uh, flow into your lungs where there's less pressure. And as air flows in, your thoracic cavity expands and you fill it up until it equals with the atmospheric pressure. And then once you relax the elasticity of your lungs, your diaphragm relaxing, that is going to make the pressure in your lungs tighter and therefore the air is going to leave your body in the exhale as it returns to its normal size. You also have things when you want to do active breathing, as if you're doing exercise or just wanted to breathe extra hard, um, you have your inter and external costal muscles, as well as your abdominal muscles, which help push out that air. Um, but for the most part, it's the diaphragm and elastic recoil of your lungs. And the contracting of the diaphragm and relaxing and the elastic recoil is what does your quiet, passive in inhaling and exhaling. Um, as far as the pressures go, your intrapleural pressure or the inter the um, intrapulmonary pressure is the air in your lungs, and that's the most when you are fully breathed in and your body starts to relax and tighten. That's when the pressure is the highest, so it pushes it out, so it equalizes with the atmospheric pressure, and it's at its lowest. When you're breathing in, your diaphragm is tightening, and it's pulling those lungs open, so the air wants to flow in and that's how it equalizes.